Meanwhile, in Tupac news, the shooting of Tupac Shakur once again underscores the violence that has surrounded this man since he shot the superstar. To Pulled up, open fire, Shakur and Knight. Tupac Shakur was shot several times in the chest. Shakur was pronounced dead. Machiavellianist, Illuminati, all through your body. The blows like a 12 gauge shot at a bad boy killer, Biggie yeah. nah later, they wondering why he breathing, but bitches is dying later. Nine millimeter cock test, one for test, uh -huh. and the winner is uh -huh. not that thin a kid. Uh -huh. Bandanas, tattoos, my fists never bruise. Better laugh now, then cry when I come to get you. I hit you with two blocks and leave you with scar tissue. Gun did it, come with it, get your head split it, or get your neck slit it. Admit it, you overdid it. Want some loco shit, my pistol smoke your shit. Let's go for dolo, bitch, and watch me flow your shit. Pretty small, illness and how freeze raise your eyebrow up. Uh. Mr. Machiavelli moving pieces like telekinesis. It's like a chess game. Let's play with real pieces. By now you figure uh -huh. He talking about that nigga But your weak ass assumptions Lead lead the dumping uh -huh. IV the pumping Shots rang and niggas brains will spill Another bad boy affiliated bad boy. nigga with him You're talking senseless Actor needs chiropractor for crack jaw Yes I rocked your chatterbox I hit the funeral room and busted his folks Lead a scene like a shadow when the blaze of smoke Dangerous you're not I gets down Twist your body round and round Upside down all of the Biggie versus Pac heads. Only Gab can do it like this. Yo, YouTube, what up? It's your homie Gab, I'm in the building. And this is Machiavelli Media. For all my Tupac versus Biggie heads. Check this out. I picked two songs that might be rare to a lot of people. Some people never took time to check the verses on these two songs. I could have went with the usual schmoozual. Like, hit him up for Tupac and Biggie Who Shot You or even Long Kiss Goodnight. But those songs are oversaturated at best. People heard the content. I already broke some of the content down myself on this channel right here. So, I decided let's take the obscure route and go with lesser known songs that both serve purpose. I picked two songs from Biggie. I picked the ugliest. And from Tupac, I picked Don't Stop. Now, the similarities in these two songs made them compatible for me to, I guess, examine them compared to each other, adjacent to each other. Now, check it out. The song The Ugliest from Notorious B.I.G. was produced by hip-hop legend Jay Dilla. That's right. Detroit stand up. <laughs> Salute to Jay, to Jay Dilla, you know what I mean? And, um... The song is a bouncy song, and it represented uh, the East Coast at that time. It sounded like what was going on. It's laid back, and Biggie flow. He's like tap dancing all over the place. And on Tupac's side, I picked Don't Stop, produced by West Coast legend Gaz. And this song sounds like the West Coast, and it, you know, and it's got some funk flavor to it, and it's mellow. And Pac just straight riding on it. Now, The Ugliest features Busta Rhymes and some members of Flip Mode. And Don't Stop features The Dog Pound. That isn't corrupt. So on this song, The Ugliest, Biggie took some subliminal shots on Pac once again. Understand exactly what he's saying because he was very direct. And his reference. Like for instance, Actor needs chiropractor for crack jaw. Actor needs chiropractor for crack jaw. Come on, man. You know who he's talking about. Or when he say, and the winner is not the thinner kid, bandana and tattoos. My fists never bruised. Never got my hands dirty. Yeah, Biggie was saying some stuff on here, man. I mean, to me, he was at least admitting, you know, for playing the part in that quad studio shooting. I mean, that's what he's saying. Or when he said, yes, I rocked your chatterbox. Yes, I rocked your chatterbox. Dangerous, you're not. I get down. Twist your body round and round. Upside down. Yes, I rocked your chatterbox. Like, yes, I did do it. Yes. 
key word was yes in that. I'm going to post the lyrics right here so you guys can check it out for yourself. Like I said, this is the Notorious B.I.G., the ugliest. All right? Rare Underground Biggie Smalls Tupac Diss. And as far as Tupac goes, with Don't Stop, Pac whole verse. <laughs> Laugh now, then cry when I come to get you. I hit you with two blocks and leave you with scar tissue. Also. His whole verse is coming in big. I'm going to put it up right here. And it starts. Now I've been called crazy to fake me. It's not possible. I give a fuck what you thought or who you bought with you. A bad boy killer. Biggie and Naya later. They wondering why he breathing it. It's done later. Laugh now, then cry when I come to get you. I hit you with two Glocks and leave you with scar tissue. On some loco, my pistol smoke yo. Let's go for dolo and watch me flow yo. Mr. Machiavelli moving pieces like telekinesis. Life is a chess game, let's play with real pieces. Shots rang, and then brains were spilt. Another bad boy affiliated has been killed. I hit the funeral and busted his folks. And leave the scene like a shadow when the blaze of smoke. Don't stop, keep going. Man. <laughs> now, yo. It's not funny, but it is funny. It's funny that, once again, the brothers sending messages through the music to each other. And, you know... On these rare releases, you get the hammer and, and kind of put them next to each other and let the responses, let them respond to each other. It's wild. The ill part about what Tupac was saying is that, yes, bad boy affiliated people was getting killed. But, I mean, come on, man. This is, this, this is, this is crazy right here. My question to y'all, you know, did you like these two rare tracks right here from Biggie and Tupac? And which one did you like the best? You know, um, did you like The Ugliest? Or are you feeling Don't Stop? Leah, tell me why though. I mean, did, did you like the flow? I tried to pick, like I say, two songs that was compatible because Pac and Biggie are such different artists that it's kind of hard to like gauge them to kind of put them next to each other. I mean, Tupac has a, a more immense and a more, um, you know, decorated hip hop career and body of work. Biggie's was short lived, you know, but both of them made a huge impact. Both of them have a huge fan base. Both of them are on the top of hip hop Mount Rushmore. So this is really not who do you like better, but out of these two songs, which ones did y'all feel the most? Here's the lyrics from Biggie's The Ugliest, the lyric breakdown. You can check out some of the lines. And, um, you know, as far as Tupac and Don't Stop, Tupac, once again, is direct in his approach. Saying Biggie's name, here's the lyrics to Don't Stop. No reason to guess or second guess any of the lines. You know exactly who he's talking about. The next question is, how do you digest some of the lyrics? Which song was better? You know, who had the better flow? Who said what? Who had the more important lyrics about the other one? Now, you know, if we was to go by who was the, the better rapper, Tupac or Biggie? Well, that's up for debate. You got some people that say Biggie's better than Tupac. You got people like myself who would say Tupac was better than Biggie. And then you had people that would just examine the facts. If you go by pure flow, I think Biggie played a lot more with his delivery and like wordplay. And I think Tupac's delivery is more aggressive and, and more venomous. You know, Biggie tries to find creative ways of saying he took a girl out on a date. 
Tupac would just come out and say, I took a girl out on a date in the rap. Biggie would say, you know, um, something more extravagant. You know, trying to play, you know, trying to spice up the line. Tupac didn't have to do all of that. I think in terms of who made the more important hip hop, that goes without a question. You know, Tupac has songs that will forever, you know, um, be relevant in hip hop. It wasn't just, you know, a radio hit. You hear Dear Mama every Mother's Day. You hear Keep Your Head Up all the time. You know, I get around. They play it at every party, every cookout. Biggie's got some hits. You still hear Juicy. You still hear Hypnotize sometimes. Um, but once again, you know, the bigger body of work definitely went to Tupac. But out of these two songs, which ones did y'all feel the most? Please leave your thoughts in the comment section. I need you guys to share and like this video. This your homie Gab. It's been a pleasure as always. I'm signing off. I'm about to hit y'all with the peace. Test one for test, uh, and the winner is uh -huh. not that thin a kid. Uh -huh. Bandanas, tattoos, my fists never bruise. Better laugh now, then cry when I come to get you. I hit you with two blocks and leave you with scar tissue.